Hey there, welcome to Life Noggin. Almost 3 million people die in America every year. Many are buried, many are cremated, but neither of those options are perfect, which begs the question, what should we do with dead bodies? What a pleasant start to this video. Let's start with the problems of current methods of burial and cremation. For starters, we're running low on burial land. It's so bad that countries are even reusing graves. Traditional burial and cremation methods aren't doing the environment any favors either. Before a body is buried, it's pumped full of toxic chemicals and carcinogens. These end up in the air, the ground, and even our drinking water. On top of that, caskets are made of mined metals and even plastics that end up decomposing in the ground. While cremation is a bit greener, it's still releasing chemicals in the air like carbon dioxide, carbon monoxide, mercury, and carcinogens. Thankfully, there are a bunch of companies racing towards solutions for these problems. Prepare yourselves, people. These are really cool, but really weird. One group called Coeo wants people to be wrapped in a suit made of mushrooms and be buried straight into the ground. This method avoids harsh chemicals and preservatives, and instead uses mushrooms and other microorganisms to help in decomposition. This allows the body to decay naturally and distribute nutrients to the soil. But if you don't want to be turned into some kind of human stroganoff, there are other options. You could even be turned into a tree when you die. How pleasant. A company called Capsula Mundi is creating a large egg-shaped capsule that will hold a whole body underground. Once the capsule is buried, a tree seedling will be planted on top. Then, the body starts to decay naturally, with the help of the carbon inside the capsule. This carbon helps microbes in the decomposition process. The idea is that the body's nutrients will feed the tree, and loved ones can go and visit a living representation of the deceased. I just hope nobody chops you down and turns you into junk mail. If these options weren't weird enough, there are some companies that want to straight up dissolve your body. Alkaline hydrolysis, also known as liquid cremation, uses an alkaline liquid bath that doesn't emit the same toxins regular cremation does, and it requires about one-eighth the amount of energy too. The body is placed in a massive tub of 300 degree alkaline liquid, and after an hour or two, most of the body is dissolved. The liquid is then poured down the drain, just like that. Done. But could any of these options be the answer to our problem of dealing with the dead? Alkaline hydrolysis is illegal in most of the United States due to its controversial nature. Plus, this method is believed to still emit around 100 pounds of carbon dioxide per person. So, not great. Being buried in a pod and giving life to a new tree sounds cool, and it could be sustainable. But planting a more mature tree that's prepared to absorb all the nutrients could be more efficient. This brings us to our third option, the mushroom suit. As ridiculous as this option may seem, Seem, it could be the most sound. A green body preparation. No casting, no burning or liquefying, just a body wrapped in fungus feeding the nearby trees. Ah, so beautiful. So would you sign up for any of these? Or do you want to go the more traditional route? Let me know in the comment section below. So we talked about being buried, but what actually happens when you die? If you're curious, Check this video out. Later on, blood starts to spill out from broken blood vessels, and since it isn't flowing around your body, you will start to look pale. Now, if you're lying down, as you probably will be, the blood will begin to travel down thanks to gravity. My name is Blocko. This has been Life Noggin. Don't forget to keep on thinking.